just accidentally met this lady on the road, our convoy of minibuses with humanitarian aid, and decided to help her, and she confirmed she desperately needs help because it's difficult to survive here. Библию дарувал тебе, помнишь? Да, 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 читай. Читай? Читай, читай. А треба Удобається? Да, Юрий, давай ящик один ще. От ми Вікторію знайшли з дідушкою, да? Да. А як дідушку звати? Як діда звати? Дід Сережа. Дід Сережа. Ну, чудово, Вікторія. Саме головне, щоб було мирно. Добре. А там, дивіться, там маєте ще продуктовий набір. І дітинці потім рюкзаки. Дякую, дякую, так. Водичку вам треба? Ні, скриниця є. Все, дякую вам. Дякую. Нехай Бог береже вас. Так, так, так. Дякую. Friends, we are in Baradyanka right now, distributing aid and giving substantial boxes of provision. You can see our team at work and this is what we give to people. They are very thankful and express sincere gratitude for your sacrificial support. Thank you for all you are doing. You can see our convoy and people are very happy because normal life is back in Baradyanka, they survive and they are helped, they are helped by your generous hearts. You can see younger generation. Thank you for standing with us. And this fence reminds about Russian bullets and how dangerous it was here just a week ago. It's a great privilege to be able to serve for you and to deliver God's love through your efforts and prayers. Met people on the streets and they asked for bread and help, so we gave them these two substantial boxes with provision and with bread. May God bless you. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you, friends. You can see thankful eyes of this woman. God bless you. Friends, you can see our convoy crossing this destroyed bridge. This is how we travel to deliver aid to Baradyanka. It's pretty challenging. Must do it because people are waiting for the provision you help us with, and you can now see even Ukrainian military trucks also working and delivering necessary supplies. So this is our realities today. Bridges are destroyed. Logistics is very difficult, but we must rebuild and renew life in Ukraine. That's why we are thankful for standing with us. You do wonderful work. And God's love is delivered to people here through your efforts and generosity.